Hi, welcome to my short tutorial. In this tutorial, we're going to show you how to create a spinning fan and switch a button to turn the spinning fan off so the player can walk through. So let me go and show you this little fan that has been made for the example. And if we go ahead and give it a animated decoration, we can go ahead and set the animation to active and it will always loop. So if we test that out, you can see that our fan is spinning and the avatar can't walk through. Fantastic. Um, now we're going to put a button down. So we'll just use a lever, default asset. And it has a button behavior that sends the message trigger. Um, I don't like using default. So we're going to change that to fan off. So we'll go ahead and change that message. And just make sure the broadcast range is within your fan area. Otherwise it won't send the message to it. Uh, but you can see it's very big. You can even click it down smaller if you want to. Awesome. All right, now we're going to go over to the fan and we're going to put a toggle behavior on. Now we want to switch the behavior off and we want to get rid of the default message here trigger. So we'll go ahead and put in the message fan what is it? Fan dot off. Fantastic. Now, if we do a quick test, we should be able to not walk through the fan and turn off the animation. And you can see the animation is turned off, but I still can't walk through the fan. The game maker doesn't turn off the physics, so we have to do a little work around for this. Uh, how do we do that? So we're going to go ahead and grab the fan and we're going to change its collision to no collisions. So the player can walk through that at any time. But we're going to have a wall. So we're going to put up a wall and line it up against the wall by holding shift. But we want to move this across so it's just on the edge of this fan. So when the animation stops, there's the gap that the player can walk through in here. And we'll just turn this wall invisible. But it still has collisions, so the player can't walk through it. Um, now if we press Control D, we can duplicate it, hold Shift to snap it, and snap it to the wall, and just move it over slightly. Now we've got two walls. When we push the button, we want to get rid of this wall here, not this one here, because we don't want the player to walk through the fan. We want them to walk through the gap. So a quick and easy way to do this is to apply a plant behavior and you just apply the message fan off. So we'll go ahead and test that now. All right, player can't walk through. We'll go ahead and push the button and player can't walk through but can walk through the gap. And there you have it. If you have any questions, just uh, send me a message in Discord. Have a great day.